Hi guys, so um welcome back to uh, a video and this is one of the games I have um liked for a long time. So this is called um Universe Sandbox and it's a game where you can just mess with the universe so if you put time there. So for this video um I'm just gonna be seeing uh what would happen if he made his sun like a million degrees. So yeah, I guess that is it. So see me the earth's average temperature is around Oh god. Why well, is only eighteen in like places like Brazil? God knows but I see the uh we are just gonna put No, I don't want this little graph in. Just get rid of that, 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 that. So this is how warm the earth is here. You can check everywhere. F for the first thing, you're gonna see what would happen if we to just sun to six thousand degrees. Okay. So this is running in micro milliseconds, so it's best you start small before we start becoming too big. Just noted something, we don't have a moon. Let me just add a moon real quick. Do you know what, why can't Mercury be our new moon? There, uh, we have our moon now. And... Yeah, not much is really happening to the air. Let me just see how my country is doing. Yeah. So this is extremely small in scale, but if you skip days, yep, their savage temperature is frozen a lot. Don't know where you get one of these. I might keep not on that. That's what the earth looks now. Oh god, it is heating up a lot. Simulation can't really faster. Yeah, that ain't good. So what we have learnt is that... Why is it still minus 63? In Antarctica, well... Oh, okay. So let's see what would happen. The sun hit 10,000. I said 10,000? Oh, this is good enough. So... It looks like good things are happening. Uh, why is Antarctica so like? Like you just get in places at 160, and then Antarctica is just enjoying this minus three. Whoa! Why is there random motion there? Okay, so the Earth. Wouldn't really be good, but let's check how warm is Mercury. 438. Venus is 588. Jeez. Now is Mars habitable? Yeah. Oh, it's a bit warm. Let me just check. Where's Pluto? There he is. Cause I'm nice. I'm gonna make Pluto a big planet. Congratulations, Pluto. Oh, Pluto's still a bit cold. So for the next bit, I'm gonna have to slow time down by a lot. And we are just gonna te times this by 10. Okay. Um, it's like much is happening. So uh, let me just speed up time a bit. Now I'm just gonna slow the rotation speed down a lot. It's best to just put it a year. Let's put it a year. Just so we can see it. So I can't really see that but there looks like England's doing okay. I'm so some places are still incredibly cold due to, um, you know, 
I wonder if Mercury still still exists. Not the Mercury, not the Moon Mercury, but okay. Let's see how Mercury's doing. Oh, is it stop eating now? Or maybe not. Look at this. The sun is just like. Okay, so we've lost Mercury. Will he lose any more planets? No, it doesn't look like it. All that's really happened is um, the sun's just done stuff. So let me check. Pluto, Pluto is slightly above habitable. But I don't know where you get the little scale, but we are like. Alright, next thing. I'm gonna have to slow time even more. I'm pretty sure the warmest um, the game can handle is this, which is um, very lightness. But oh, I've seen here. Um, the earth is heating up very fast. My game's lagging a bit as well. Okay, Earth's just um, it's getting a bit warm now. Oh no, Mercury, no! I'm pretty sure all the planets are burning now. Mars is twenty thousand degrees. Jupiter is ten thousand degrees. I wonder if there's any objects that. None of you believe me that this is the hottest this one can get. Um, I try to try ten times in it. Yeah. I mean, like, Mercury is like. Yeah, so that's what happens, so. Just for a bit of better stuff, we're going and taking it on planets, and my game can handle it. So for this one, let us just make the sun. If you don't know what Kelvin it is, it's above the, um, the lowest temperature possible. So it's 727 degrees. So if we can just get this and take all the videos off. So, just so we can sort of see like how the F is we are just going to change it to a year, not a year. Twelve months exactly. Yeah, this is good. Bye. But why are we? One day. Why did I speed that up? Oh. Um, did not mean to do that, guys. <laughs> One year. Um, is it F cooling? Oh yeah, it is. Can you actually see the ice button? This one's better. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, let me just stop here. So, because uh, um, the sun is so unlight, this is literally how bright the earth will be. So, you know, not very bright, but... I don't know why bits of this is frozen. The earth is 2.42 degrees. Average temperature, anyway. Looks like some places are still alright. Stop out. 
Hey, yeah. Okay, that is very good. As you can see, though, sea levels just went down, so. And the warmest place on Earth is 10 degrees. Which is not good at all. Also, some islands might get bigger. It won't be long until. I stop it when. Okay, so the last place is alive, or place is like... Why is it... Some places in Australia can survive. Before long, we are just gonna die. Um, good. Don't know why the oceans haven't froze yet. I think they have, actually. Let me check ice thickness. Jupiter might be higher, um, Venus might be habitable, probably not Mercury because it doesn't keep the light. Why is Venus 240 degrees so what? I think it's because it traps most of its light. In, yeah, look how slow it's pulling down. Eventually even Venus is habitable. The next thing, <laughs> we are going to just increase in mass of the sun. Might increase its radius as well. Okay, I don't know why, but the sun's radius just gave up on me. Um, I don't think you really meant to do it with that. Okay, just slow down. I think it's best to just click the plus thing, or the sun becomes like the size of Earth. Look at that, it just caused the size of Earth. What? Don't wanna make it too big or become a black hole. Let's make it a thousand tons. Just gonna keep killing down. No, oh, it looks like it won't. What the hell? I don't know what I've done. <laughs> so I don't think it's you can unlock it. Okay, so the sun gave up on life. Why is the setting always got to go so fast? Um. Okay, maybe this will work a bit better. So let's just mess up on the buttons now. So let's just send a big black hole. A black hole, 10,000 solar masses. I will do 10 million after. You know, what would happen if we launched it at the sun? Oh god, look at that density. It's only like tiny, even though it's 10 masses of sun. We're going in light speed. The 
Let's just make it go one light speed. Oh god, it messes up with me view a bit. Um, I didn't mean for it to go that way, but if it slowed down enough, in kilometers. Let's make it go like 100 kilometers per second. I don't think light speed is very good. That might be a bit slow because before long it's just gonna bring it, but um. on earth has it done to earth? Okay, it's sending everything towards it. Okay, rip it off. God. It's about, is it gonna eat the sun up? What the heck? Earth just lost half its mass. Does it even have an orbit anymore? Uh, yeah, it does. With... Um... Okay, I guess that isn't very dumb. <laughs> I guess it... Alright, for this next one, I'm just gonna put, um... Let's do it in the actual solar system this time. No, not just promise. So if we um, put as far as the orbit is Sedina, black hole, hence all of us.